It's 7.13. I'm at work. I'm off at 8.30. I've been up since 6.25. This is how I'm on. These videos are gonna start off by the way. I'm watching ridiculousness. Okay. My hands are ashy. And you can't really tell, but like, you can fucking tell that they're actually right. <laughs> so. Go to my grandma's house, cause that's where I'm staying for the time being. It's cool working overnight, but like, I'll be sleep all day. I'm really in like my resting era at the moment. So, <laughs> wow. <clears throat> um. It's 8.30. What's today, Thursday? Oh shit, I can't even go home right? Go home, I can't even go to my grandma's house right now. Like y'all can see the dryness in my face now. Oh my gosh. Did y'all see the cracks in between my hands? Let me stop. Um, I have a doctor's appointment. I totally forgot about that. I'm finna go there. It's 8.30, it's at 9.15, so I'm just finna like, in the parking lot so I'm gonna talk about it because I'm gonna post a video on TikTok about it later talking about the same thing but like people that are overthinkers first of all everybody has a superpower I would just like to say that everybody has a superpower but we're just it's like so lost in history you know what I'm saying it's lost history type of shit and um nobody is taught it nobody is taught how to use our superpowers usually the quiet people are the ones that are like more tapped in and i'm just here to explain really one of them but then go over um a couple of them i guess one of the main ones that i want to go over is people that are overthinkers genuinely because um i was an overthinker myself you know what I'm saying? The thoughts get very loud. And over time, learning to calm my thoughts and really understanding it, what I have found out is that when you're an overthinker, you're not overthinking. You're hearing everyone else's thoughts plus your own. That's why we can come up with every scenario possible in our head and we can still be right about whatever we were I guess thinking about because it wasn't just only us thinking about it we can hear what the other people were thinking so it's like we say we're overthinking because it's just like we can't comprehend what's our voice in our head and what isn't our voice in our head so once you fully begin to understand and calm down like the voices in your head and you can decipher what your own voice is saying then you could be like, oh, okay. If they're doing something and they're having a conversation with me, but they're thinking about what they're doing, I can hear them thinking about the shit that they're talking about in their head while they're also talking. No, they can be cooking and they can be talking about what they did today, like having a full-on conversation or whatever. And then it's just like, I'm not even listening to what they're talking about, like how their day was. I'm listening to them talk in their head because they're cooking and they're like shit I don't want to burn this like I hope this tastes good like or they could be like I've never cooked this before type of shit and it's just like it's funny to me because I don't listen to what the person is actually saying I'm listening to what the fuck they're saying in their head and it's just like I don't say anything I just like sit back and I just like watch the whole thing play out because it's just like people tend to like speak with their facial expressions as well so it's <laughs> ah, it's so funny it's funny to me it's funny to me so overthinkers you can actually i guess read people's mind i don't like to say read people's mind but like you can hear what they're saying i encourage people to like calm their minds all the time because i know how bad it can be as an overthinker that non-overthinkers um like won't understand you're put in autopilot once you start overthinking so it's just like you're not there like you're so lost 
and like the voices in your head and like the mind shit and just like constantly fucking thinking that like you don't even know the shit that you're doing like it's literally like you're on autopilot like you know like when you're driving and then you completely doze off and then you end up like five miles down and you're like when the fuck did i get here like that's how it is with overthinking another thing is people that daydream you know i'm still learning it myself because i am like a daydreamer myself but um people that daydream can see into the future and they can see into the past they can not only see their future and their past they can see other people's future and their past i don't really have like too much you know insight on that i just like i said i'm still learning more about it when you're learning stuff like this in like spiritual references you can uh, understand stuff more when you're around other people that think the same as you because everyone learns at their own pace but it's really more so you learn from experience if you're around people that think like you and then they bring in their own opinions like oh like da 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 this is what like i've learned from my experience you know what i'm saying this is like this then you guys can like literally like put two and two together and then you guys can just come up with so much stuff and it's just like it helps you grow knowledgeable because math wasn't made by one person it was made by multiple people so it's just like um eventually i will be around more people that think like i do so i'll be able to like expand my knowledge and like share it with people but until then like this is as far as i've you know as far as i gotten i guess another one would be um hearing so you know how people be like oh i have hearing like a mom like how moms can hear anything like i have mom ears or like some people be like i can literally hear a pin drop type of shit so with that like if you hear ringing in your ears and you have like really good hearing already it's more so you have to meditate for that learn to really sit in silence and just listen like you have that ability to just listen not necessarily listen to people talk but you are able to hear plants like in pocahontas how she was able to talk to the tree how she was able to like learn another language it's because she was really good at like listening you know like she wouldn't talk as much but like she can listen so she was able to follow the wind because she could hear the wind speak she was able to speak the animals because um she was just listen so you are able to hear in um a higher pitch like when your ears are ringing that's when like the spirits are talking to you like your spirit guides your ancestors are talking to you and they're trying to like send you a message and you have that ringing in your ears because you're able to hear it but like since you choose not to listen it's like you can't hear what they're saying so it's just like your ears are ringing if you're meditating and you're focused on the ringing in your ear your ears will literally pop and you'll hear whispering and then like a voice will like start talking in your head and you'll be able to understand it um and with listening like you'll be able to understand different languages like me i speak english and i have no idea what anybody is saying in any other languages but if i like really sit and i listen or if it's just like if i'm not paying attention to it or if i'm like ear hustling ear hustling is like being nosy i can hear what you're saying or i know exactly what you're saying so somebody could be talking spanish in line behind me and not necessarily talking about me but like they're just having a conversation and if I so happen to just like zone in, like randomly pay attention to what they're talking about, then it's like I can hear like what they're saying clearly. Like I know the language or if my name were to be brought up in a conversation, it doesn't matter where I'm at. Like I could be in the bathroom, go and pee. And then the person that's like bringing up my name could be like sitting in the car talking about somebody and then out of nowhere i could just be like what the fuck you know what i'm saying like i like this person's talking about me and then i have confronted a couple people sometimes like say if the person was like actually like saying something 
and then like I would come face to face with them I'd be like hey da 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 did you bring this up about me and they'd be like yeah and I'd be like yo (laughs) so it's just like our powers go so deep but it's just it takes time patience motivation determination and like discipline to like really learn that and you it's like you have to keep it consistent because the abilities will fade like me I'm not able to hear plants animals or the wind speak anymore truly because like I stopped listening but that is something that's deeper on its own like in order to listen like you have to like listen and you have to sit in silence you know so it's just like it's a lot (laughs) But yeah, that's it. I'm going to go in here. I think they're open now. Um, I started filming at 830. I've been filming for like 17, 22 minutes now. So it should be like 50 or like on the 40. So I'm I'm just going to chill on my phone until it's time for me to go inside. It looks like a person's already in there. So I guess I'm going to go in. But uh, I'll see you guys later. Okay, y'all. I'm in here and literally soon as I got out the car, I locked the keys in the car, in the ignition. What? So, I called for reinforcements. So, we'll see. I'm getting the COVID test. I've been here four times in the last three weeks. I'm here, finally, in the truck. I was sitting outside for probably like a good 20 minutes, but it didn't feel like 20 minutes I got my appointment at 9, left my appointment at like 9, um, probably like 9.30, 9.40, something. Uh, was waiting for my grandpa to get here. He helped me open up the door. Now I'm inside. It's 10 o'clock for sure. I'm definitely a big person in believing that things are delayed and not denied. When inconveniences pop up or things didn't go as planned, literally just smile through it and just laugh. Because either way, like, at the end of the day, you're going to be laughing about it. And it's, everything's always a, everything's always a funny situation. Basically, what that means is that whatever you're asking for will come later instead of when you think it will come. It's just preparing you for something else. So, yeah. It's currently 1044. I've been speaking my word. I posted what I was just talking about uh, on TikTok about the superpowers. Bob is jumping on me and oh it's going away 10:33 now 10:44 airplane flying over me means we're going places speaking upon delayed but not denied everything happens for a reason everything happens to you to happen for you like no a rainbow and the clap was that line already there? Dance if you gay, Bruce. Dance if you gay, Bruce. He's not feeling it, but I'm finna go inside, eat me some cereal. I don't know if I told you guys, but I had COVID two weeks ago. And I just tested negative for it. I'm so happy about it, but yeah. So, me and Bob, we got a busy week. Tomorrow, I have a doctor's appointment. Saturday, Bob has a doctor's appointment. And then we're moving on to Sunday, and that's a whole different week on its own. Oh, the time is 11. It's 11 o'clock. It's 11. I checked the time to get the exact time. It said 11, 12. It's 11, 12. Y'all, it is 4.50. I did take a nap from the last time that I recorded. I think I've been up since probably like 4, maybe 3. Um, I went outside to use the bathroom. I refilled his bowls and stuff. I'm going to make me another quesadilla. Because I'm getting hungry. I might make me like 2. But I didn't draw one of these. Like, like I remembered, but like. I didn't remember. I forgot. So we're going to draw it. So last night when I was editing the video, I was definitely like, I probably like should have read it on camera. So I'm going to do that. 
so this is the one for today um I don't want to read it <laughs> okay if I read it I read it if I don't then I don't but I'm gonna plop it back in there and I guess I'll do that I'm gonna put it back down so oh. it's 5 12 I made my quesadillas um they got butter on the top of them but they kind of toasted on the other side like, I didn't make it on a skillet. Like, I just put it... I don't know what kind of toaster it is. My grandma has, but it's a toaster. So, made that. But I'll talk to y'all later. I ate that first case of the year. I don't know if I'm gonna eat the second one. Like, I'm hungry, but chocolate we're just like... Not too much food, but it's just like a... Like, your mouth can't chew anymore. Buddy boy is tired. He's tired. Last time I seen the time it said 19 something. Which means it's 7. <sighs> I gotta get in the shower. <laughs> yeah, he was knocked out here. I was like, no idea what's going on. Um, I never finished that case of deal. Yeah, no, that was my second one. <laughs> Sorry for the ankle, but I'm fresh out the shower, but not like this one, baby pals. Um, I dried my face with a face towel because I do wash my face in the shower. It's just more convenient. Then I put this on my face. It's a daily hydration overnight face oil I literally like don't squeeze it because it's like some that's like on the outside of the tube it is glass and then when I get to my cheek I like to squeeze a little bit like you see what I mean just that rub it into the hairline on the cheeks on the mouth down the bird on my toes the sides of my nose I just like always dry Cause I'm always messing with it. My skin has changed a lot in the last two years. Like it changed drastically. It went from being very oily to very dry. So at this point, I just like use what works. And you guys know this. You can put it on your body. Um, I'm usually gonna do that. Like if I like. Mm, I just put them on my hands simply because like my hands are like the only thing that show and I'm gonna rub it down my arms a little bit I'm gonna end the video here um let me see what time it is okay it's currently 8 18 I'm gonna end the video here I'm gonna edit it and then I'm gonna upload it thank you guys for watching my vlogmas day 2 like it's it's gonna get better for here from here trust me so yeah um if you guys enjoyed like comment and subscribe um and i'll see you guys all in my next one